have, uh, we are going to concentrate on our core competence, which is going to be the trunk level technology. We have three technology managers, and as such, we're going to be doing that at the time. Okay, so uh, when this technology will be ready, uh, we expect in less than two years we can uh, use this technology because nowadays we can use it for uh, recover dead heart tissues. So, who are our key competitors? Of course, we have uh, another other biotech companies and lobbies. Uh, we have, uh, for example, Bristol Therapeutics, and in Europe we have Genostem. And it's a European consortium with a $12 million budget, so it's very powerful. But they are all not uh, sport specific, they are uh, uh, biotech in general, so we can uh, use the technology for our business. Of course, uh, the true competitors are the other sports insurance that can use biotech technology to sell this kind of product. Okay, so why do we need uh, your money? Okay, first of all, we need to be the first in the market, so we need to create our commercial structure in the sports world. So we are uh, using 20% of the money in this uh, area, and when we close uh, contracts with the teams, we are going to use the money in the technology. So we are going to invest in medical research aligned with our commercial purposes. Uh, biotech is a very huge area, but we only need about muscles, uh, dentals, and so on. Um, uh, we, uh, maybe Professor Robert, Robert Langes at lab at MIT. And as Jose said, we are going to outsource the stem cell storage. By the end of uh, 2010, we are, we are going to be ready to be in the market and we want to be consolidated in the US market by the end of 2011. And next year, we want to expand to Europe, so the championships in weeks. So there's a lot, of, a lot of players, very expensive there, so they can use our technology. And of course, there are other players and athletes that may need this technology in the future. So we are Celera, and thank you.